So here's an interesting clip I found you guys are going to be seeing. So Secular Talks Kyle Kalinske has been someone who's been on TYT a lot. And if you're part of his audience, you know that a lot of people want him to leave TYT because they believe that he is better. And I, I would definitely agree, hands down. Um, and they advocate for him leaving. Uh, a lot of it is because of Janky Rue, but also of others. Um, here you're going to be seeing Kyle talking about his disagreements and kind of his status with the Young Turks. Check it out here. In association with Jank Uger, how much do you interact with each other and how much do you think you agree with one another? Uh, so I'm part of TYT Network. I've been for years. Um, Jank and I interact quite a bit for Justice Democrats because we are two co-founders. It was me, Jank. Um, we really came up with the idea and then we teamed up with other people who were thinking about doing something like this, those people being Zach Exley and Shoykat Chakrabarti. They are um, former top Bernie Sanders campaign officials. So it was a match made in heaven because, you know, him and I have strong ideas on how to make the Democratic Party succeed and just how to get progressive policies implemented, how to get populist left ideas implemented. And, but we don't have the time... And it's just not what we do to really lay the groundwork and lay the infrastructure and do the hard work um, to actually carry it out and get the people elected and run the campaigns and do all the organizing. So that's why it just, again, match made in heaven because we teamed up with Bernie Sanders campaign officials who agree with us on all the issues who are like, let's do this thing. So um, we talk maybe uh, once a week or every other week sometimes for issues regarding uh, Justice Democrats. And in terms of areas where I disagree with uh, Jank and other uh, TYT hosts, there's a number of issues, man. But that's fine. I mean, that's well, I'm really, I'm supposed to agree with everybody. <laughs> I'm supposed to agree with everything they say, and they're supposed to agree with everything I say. No, not at all. There's some vehement disagreement. Of course, we disagree massively uh, on the Russia issue, um, and I haven't really spoken about that with him. Um, because we're, we've just been dealing with other stuff, Justice Democrats related, but we disagree on the Russia issue. Um, I know that we disagree on taxes to an extent. I've always said that when it comes to middle class people and poorer people, I've never seen a tax cut I don't like. Um, I know he was in favor of getting rid of all of the Bush tax cuts, which means even the tax cuts for the middle class and the poor. Um, so I think... He would like a higher rate on middle class people than I would. So I'm more in the camp of tax cuts for middle class people than he is. Uh, I think we disagree on free trade, although I think he's come around more to my side over the years. He used to be he used to be fine with free trade and say, like, I don't know what the alternative is, basically, was his argument. If we're not going to trade with him, what are we going to do? Um, I'm much more protectionist. Uh, I love the idea of tariffs. I love the idea of crafting laws that make corporations keep jobs in the U.S. and not outsource them. I don't think he's 100% in agreement with me there. We also disagree pretty strongly on foreign policy. I'm a rather committed non-interventionist, um, whereas he is, I think he's referred to himself as a mild interventionist, which means every now and then he's fine with sending U.S. troops to unilaterally do some sort of mission. I'm much more in favor of doing nothing unless we're directly threatened. Like, for self-defense, sure, let's do military action. But outside of that, only, you know, um, international action, if we do it with other nations to stop a genocide or something. I don't like U.S. military action unilaterally unless we're directly threatened. I think in some cases he's okay with that. Um, and I don't know, I, I think on social issues, I'm a little more libertarian too. So I'm a libertarian leftist, and on social issues, I'm live and let live, you know, legalize all drugs, you do whatever the fuck you want. I think we agree overall on 90% of stuff.